Okay, so in this screencast I'll show you how to tune a PID control loop in the Simulink simulation environment. And in the previous video I showed how to set up the, the PID control loop, all of the elements involved there and what they represented. I also showed how you could increase the control again until we got these regular oscillations within the, the response of the control loop. And when we measure the peak-to-peak -peak values uh, we've, we get the ultimate period for the system and also we take the control again at this point and that is the control again for marginal stability. Now if we just come over to Excel and I just show you we put these values in KCM, PU, the control again for marginal stability, the ultimate period there and we just for this video I'm just going to show you the Ziegler Nichols uh, tuning approach which says that we need 0.5 of the, con the controller gain for marginal stability if we want just peak control or we've got these other ratios here if we want PI control or PID control different values that need to be used for the reset time and uh, values for the rate time so we've got TR the reset time TD the rate time and actually it's just calculated out over here and we have values for KC 1 over TR and TD because of course in the simulation we need 1 over TR so this calculates out as 1 divided by the ultimate period times by 0.5 um, and these values can then be put into the simulation and we can then see how the simulation responds once we get these tuning parameters in so let's just make sure we can see what we need and for this one it's 1.386 click OK there, 1 over TR, let's have a look at what that needs to be, 0.318 and TD, that needs to be 0.787, click OK and then we can rerun the simulation now with these optimised and tuned values according to Ziegler Nichols we can look at the scope and we can see now that we get this response where there's no offset which is what we expect for PID control uh, it does shoot up sharply, it overshoots and then comes back down and gets to the set point value and overall that is how you can tune your PID control loop using the Ziegler-Nichols approach